Hey, hey, y'all, and welcome to our Saturday. We are at Paul Paul's house. We're going to be doing some things here today, and I thought it'd be fun to bring you along. Paul Paul still does a lot of stuff for himself as far as taking care of the house, but there are some things like cleaning out the gutters or getting under the house. So, hey, Paul Paul, let us help you do it. So, that's what we're going to be doing today, and I think we're also going to do fish fry and just have a good time. And I wanted to bring you along, and I wanted to capture the memories so that I would have them. Before we get into what we got going on right now though, let's go back in time to this morning because Audrey and I and Fletcher, we went to the Blooming Festival in Coleman, which is a lot of fun. Hey, sweetheart, how are you? How are you, sweet girl? You playing? I know, ain't you cute? We went to the Blooming Festival this morning. If you're around Coleman, then you probably know about it. You've probably been. It's the place to be, and it was a lot of fun. So I'm going to share a few clips of that with you, and then we'll catch back up. like the kids have been out here picking flowers. Yes, and I got flowers. <laughs> That's sweet. I think that had a hole in it. I got a face full of chicken feed dust. They let the chickens out. Some musky dine vines are looking pretty. Nice and green. You're fine. Step over it. There you go. Good job. You want to hold my hand? Played so hard, you need ice cream. Hey, 
Mine connected to my phone. Really? Yeah, it would. It wouldn't stay. It's Sunday now. I came to the store to get the few things we need to get um, dinner going in the crock pot for tonight. And I cannot find brown gravy or aju gravy mix. Can you guess what we're having? Found it. Justin got our roast, our Mississippi pot roast going in the crock pot. It's dark right here. Let me move it. Look at this beautiful broom that I got at that festival yesterday. Isn't that gorgeous? I think I'm going to put a hook right here on the side of these cabinets to hang it. Real quick before we go to church, I think I'm going to try to cut up some potatoes, some seed potatoes, because I want to plant a few more probably in a felt um, planter. I'm mean, a bag, a felt bag. And so I'm going to get those cut so that they can be scabbing over and healing from the cut for a few hours. These are some gold potatoes from the store. And I don't know if I said this in the seed potato video where we were planting, but a lot of times in the store they'll be sprayed with a sprout inhibitor, but if you're buying organic potatoes, they won't. And so usually you can use those to plant if you need to. And this is some organic potatoes that started growing eyes. So we're gonna plant them. Big step. Good job. It's later in the day. We went to church. We went out and had lunch. We went to a Mexican restaurant for lunch. And we're back home. Just kind of been chilling. Justin took Easton. They were doing a little batting practice today for baseball. So the boys went with him. The older two boys went with him. The little two boys had been napping. I think Audrey was watching the Braves. But anyway, I need to start working on some mashed potatoes to go with our roast for supper. And maybe, um, what are we going to do for bread? Maybe we'll do some mayonnaise rolls to go with it. 
I don't know if I'm going to put those potatoes in that felt bag today. It's just going to depend on how much time I end up having to like, actually get outside and work on it. If I don't, that's fine. It would actually be better for them to sit a little bit longer and let that cut part scab over. So I don't know if that'll happen. We'll have to see. Audrey says she would make the mayonnaise rolls. There's nothing real exciting about <laughs> making mashed potatoes. I don't know. Maybe maybe there is. I'm just going to peel some potatoes, cut them up, and get them boiling. So I'm going to set the camera up and let you watch Audrey make mayonnaise rolls. I thought we were going to have to change up plans and not do mayonnaise rolls because we went to get the mayonnaise out. We didn't have any. We didn't have any. I didn't want to have to wait on Justin to get home because I wanted to have everything ready when they got back. So, because he would have definitely picked us up some, and he's still going to get some on the way home since we don't have any. But, one of the perks of living next door to Mama, Audrey ran over there to borrow some mayonnaise. While Audrey had walked over to get mayonnaise from my Mama, I decided I would go ahead and set the camera up while I was peeling potatoes. Now, I used to never peel potatoes, not even for mashed potatoes. I did not like peeling potatoes, didn't want to do it, and I didn't. But I've gotten to a place where I appreciate it, and I think that's because it brings back so many memories of sitting at my mama and papa's table. Mama had arthritis, and she could not peel potatoes, but she liked her potatoes peeled, and she did fried potatoes and mashed potatoes often and Papa would sit at the table and peel those potatoes for her, as many as she wanted and I can remember sitting at that table many many times helping him peel potatoes he would usually use a knife and he would peel them and you'll see in just a second too I'm, I'm using a cutting board and a larger knife to cut mine up but Papa would stand beside the pot with a knife and just cut little pieces of potato off into the pot and now being able to stand here and peel potatoes and make homemade mashed potatoes, it just it makes me think of my mama and my papa and the many times that I sat around their kitchen table with papa peeling potatoes and mama cooking dinner. I'm going to leave a link for the recipe that Audrey's using down in the description box. We did add a little bit of sugar, about a tablespoon or so of sugar, and I can't remember if the recipe called for that or not, but the recipe will be linked down in the description box. Potatoes are ready to mash, and look how beautiful Audrey's mayonnaise rolls are.
Don't go anywhere. I'm going to show you a clip of our dinner plate before I close out the video. I put my sweatshirt on. I'm about to go out and do evening chicken chores. And it's a little bit cool outside right now. I didn't get to the potatoes today. I was kind of waiting on Justin to get home so that, you know, I just had some help with the little boys and it was just a little bit easier for me to go outside and dedicate a little time to that. And Easton ended up practicing significantly longer than I thought he was going to. So they're still not home yet, but they're on their way. So supper will be ready for them when they get here. So potatoes didn't get done. That's okay. They're, they're ready to go in the felt bag and I can do that tomorrow. I'll, I will find a way to get that done tomorrow. It'll be all right. Like I said, don't go anywhere and I'll show you a clip of our dinner plate. We love you. We appreciate you. We'll see you in the next one. Bye y'all.